the day is ending as it started in the garden I'm just giving a bit of water to various parts of the lawn and um, it's been a full day it's been an absolute full day today May's worked herself to a standstill that's her habit she don't have pee me off she starts working in, in, in the garden or anything she does and she works like an absolute Trojan and she won't stop until she's completed whatever she's doing and she can be absolutely dead on her feet and, uh, and I say to her sweetheart do a couple of hours coming out the sun do a couple of hours tomorrow coming out the sun no 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 she gets all wrapped up hat on scarf on big clothes on wellies on jeans on covered up like a bedouin and uh, and gets at it so so what a beautiful evening it, it's just gone five o'clock and uh, I've uh, I've made four liters of uh, Kato soup for uh, Stephen to take to him tomorrow I've uh, I've roasted or well, roasting in the oven now as we speak a, a bacon joint which I will video and I'll I'll do it, I'll show it you with, with with the bacon I sliced the other day and um, I bet I don't smell too good because I'm desperate for a shower compost is cooking away everything's quiet What a glorious evening. You know, I've always enjoyed going to Pattaya. Um, and I, my enjoyment is, is probably threefold uh, when I go to Pattaya. Number one is, is clearly I was, it was seeing Stephen, but he's up here now, so I don't need to go down. Number two was the restaurants I could go to, so the different choices of the food I don't get up here and uh, number three was was clearly the, uh, the 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 food shopping i could get brands from back home that i that I, I struggled to get up here i mean they're all available online so don't get me wrong they are available but it was just nice to to walk into the expat shops and and, and browse and and as you as you're browsing it, it it's it, when you see something it's a little trip down memory lane isn't it you know so uh, I always, I mean, I'll, I, I don't think I'll ever go again because I said Stephen's up here now, so I don't need to go down. And um, but make it, making the things, it it floats my boat to make things, you know. It, 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 whether it's cooking or whether it's in the workshop or joinery or or what have you, I just enjoy creating, and little things like. Anybody from the UK would will uh, will uh, reminisce about bonfire night and uh, and parking. Parking is a very heavy, sticky cake that's made with molasses, oats, demerara sugar, uh, butter, and uh, you just fold the mix and then put it in a in a tin and and, and bake it for about 35, 40 minutes, and then once once it's gone cold you then put it in a in a, a cake tin or a airtight container and leave it for about four or five days and the longer you leave it the more sticky it goes and i love to make things like parking because again it, it's just a reminiscent of of my grandmother uh, or my mother making it at home you know um, little memories bonfire night treacle toffee molasses toffee um the P and Am soup, little things, you know. I make a lot of Indian curries because I love Indian food. And um, one day, I'll tell you a story. But uh, when I worked in India, and my bosses asked me to be a a, a drug mule, asked me to to bring drugs back to the UK. You know, I'll, I'll tell you that story one day. It's really deadly interesting. Clearly, I didn't. I'm going to uh, 
switch this sprinkler off and and go and get a shower have a look at that that um, bacon joint that's roasting now tonight I'm having a treat I've got some water in the freezer chilling right down and I'm going to make some batter because when you make batter chip shop batter uh, it's always best to make it with ice cold water and uh, our nephew and his mate Anne, the little boy's dad, uh, he, he's a he's a mechanic at, at Mitsubishi. But uh, at the weekend, on his day off, he went to the river and and they were they were fishing, and he brought a he brought back a snakehead. Now a snakehead is a it's a predator fish. It's an attack fish, and when you look at the head, it looks it looks like a snake, and. Uh, but being a being a, a predator fish and wrap it in the water, it's it's very firm, muscly flesh, and I've never eaten it. But Jeff told me, battered and cooked uh, fish and chips is what I'm having tonight, and um, Jeff said it's just like being in the UK and having cod. We will see. I will let you know. So I'm going to go and make my batter and um, and make my fish and chips. So from paradise on this beautiful, beautiful evening, sat with the sun going down. It's, uh, I shall bid you all a very good night. And I wish that each and every one of you could retire and be as deliriously happy here that I am. See you later.